Hey, what is going on YouTube? This is Robert and today I'm bringing you to an unboxing. I know, two in one week, how amazing. Um, but today's unboxing is going to be for Palace. Uh, I did have uh, another like couple of items that I bought. Um, I believe I bought them on Sunday and they're meant to be like 24 or 48 hour tracks that they would be like quick-ish, uh, but I, I don't know what's going on. Don't know what's going on with them. They're not here, uh, they haven't been shipped, so. No clue, no clue. Uh, but regardless, we're going to get on with Palace. Uh, it's only obviously a couple of items, so yeah. Let's get into it anyway. Uh, and as per norm, let me know down below whether or not your items arrived from Palace or not. I'll be honest, mine have been here a couple of days. They, they have, they really have. Palace, you were so fast shipping these. So fast, so very fast. So yeah, uh, I should have recorded this the other day, but I thought I'd leave it uh, a little bit of a gap. I did upload anyway, but yeah, uh, let's get into it anyway. Okay, so, obviously, Palace, easy, single box, you know, great. Uh, is it me, this is a tiny thing, but is it me, or have people noticed that, like, the Palace labels that have either been on packages or on boxes in general have been getting, like, smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller, like, the ones that we used to have would be absolutely massive, and now they're just becoming to the point where it's just, like, this little sliver of a, um, of an address or of whatever on it, but I'm not complaining because it makes it easier to take off the box, but yeah, they are just getting like... <laughs> so, anyway. Okay, so, as per norm, I'm terrible at opening uh, packages, especially when they come from Palace, because Palace love to use like a solid chunk of tape, and that's just my downfall. So, as always, away from you for safety, you know, safety tip number one when unboxing, you know, away from you. Don't look at any of my previous unboxings where I do it towards myself, because it's not true, it's just flipped. Did I just, was there no point in me cutting this bit? Yeah, there was no point, I just did that. Just did that, okay. Okay, we're open, knife, be gone. Um, safety tip number two, uh, <laughs> if you're pushing down and then wanting to go the opposite way, turn the knife around, don't try and just pull up on it, because <laughs> it won't end well, right. Anyway, Palace, cool, week one, so, week one summary for Palace, realistically, personally, I should have bought the Corduroy Cordial uh, bag, I just should have, it just, I, I just should have bought it, I really should have, uh, other than that, I just got to chill, just got a massive chill, okay, uh, other than that, the Zen work jacket, also in olive, I really, I should have, but at the same time, it's kind of like, I wasn't really looking to drop £500 on week one of Palace, because, there's the rest of the season, there's Supreme up and coming, you know, it's just one of those things. But yeah, anyway, like I said, let me know if any of your things have arrived uh, from Palace or what they were and such. Is that a different colour? Because I I remember that on the, uh, for the photo, it was like blue, wasn't it? But maybe that's just me. Oh, and then there's a sticker, Palace. Longboard 586? I don't know. I have no idea. That's also a different thing to normal. I will go up uh, and show in a moment. Oh, obviously we've got the mob grip, uh, which I always find cool that Palace uh, do like just include that or ship that. I have said to people before, whenever I get it, does anyone like actually want it? Because now I've got two sets of it. So if anyone genuinely does, I'd, I'd be happy, more than happy, more than like to just, more like obliged to help in the end. Because yeah, I'm, I'm not going to be skateboarding. Is there a sticker? There is. <laughs> yeah. Hooray. Um, <laughs> Right, but yeah, I always appreciate that Palace do that because I know that some of the people who will be buying, uh, I don't know if people will be skating the American Psycho one, probably someone out there will be, uh, but I know for the other boards it's probably extremely useful for those who purchase from Palace as like a frequent thing. Get some free grip, nice and easy, it sorts out some of the problems. So yeah, first and foremost, we have the American Psycho T uh, in medium. Um, yeah. There's, there's, <laughs> there's nothing uh, special to go over or go uh, about it. I, I don't really know what I'm going to be doing with it, personally. Um, obviously, I have the option to sell. It's like, cool, you know, it's, it's 50, 40, whatever. It's, it's got profit to it, but at the same time, I'm like, I could wear it on holiday. It'd be cool. I don't 
really like unbox or take out a lot of teas that I've had as of late. Uh, I know that I've got my Pala it might be Palaska, but I think it's the Paloha uh, tea instead. Yeah, Paloha tea uh, in grey to take with me. I haven't tried it yet, which is a bit of a bad thing because if palace size in for medium is bad, um, <laughs> it's not really going to work. But yeah, uh, now I've got this obviously in medium. Uh, I go medium nowadays because I'm medium, uh, but I also feel in a lot of uh, teas and things, due to some places making them a little bit oversized, medium's becoming like the new large. It's just what people are purchasing. Anyway, skateboard. It's cool, uh, but the detail before we look at it is that it says Edward R. Pressman, uh, Firm Corp, 2023 copyright, which I've never noticed before on any uh, palace pieces or palace decks uh, that have had uh, sort of a graphic or an artwork to them but maybe they did that last year with Elton John I don't know I didn't buy it so let's go with uh, the other side first instead for the business card uh, and yeah let's take that up close so obviously as you can see uh, that is how it looks uh, with the business card and then we go out and obviously you've just got red uh, I thought it was blue but maybe they're different colors for it uh, and then obviously we have our main man I really appreciate the editing like job uh, that they did for this it's really good it's a really clean like edit and work uh, that they've done changing uh, it from like this clear sort of tone to the white with the palace logo whoever did it like props to you you really did a good job I, I was quite, like really happy seeing that um, but yeah so that is the deck or the board in the end. Um, I obviously don't have many skateboards or decks left uh, in general. How am I going to sit that like that? It's just going to slide anyway. Um, yeah, I don't have many decks or boards left in general. Obviously, you know, in like 2017, I had 30 something. I cut that down, cut that down. Uh, when I moved, I had still like 17, I think. Uh, and now I've got four, three. Something like that. I don't have many. I do not have many. It's just the truth. Yeah. Um, it's just one of those things where it was space plus, I mean, some are still up for sale, uh, but they're in storage. But it's just like space plus, you know, just not really being too much into needing them. Like they're just sitting there collecting dust. I'd rather just have a couple of cool ones instead uh, that I like around. So I've obviously got my ET, I've got my Sean Cliver got this I could obviously sell it at some point in time but I do just think it's really cool um, it's unique so yeah uh, there's still the palace polo one but I don't know that that's sort of the cycle of reselling isn't it where if it's bought from StockX for like uh, 78 pounds then you could sell it for like 200 that's the whole point of using StockX so yeah I really wish that I got more from that polo club I really do the sweater the sweaters just a real grail but anyway regardless uh, that is going to cover this video I'm just rambling I get into that habit of just going 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 but yeah uh, that is going to cover this video so as per norm let me know down below what you picked up whether or not it arrived whether or not you went in store or not or if you took an L because things just went you know like that I uh, can't click, it's so cold. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that is going to cover this video. So I do hope that you have a good rest of your day. Uh, I haven't really copped anything else recently. I was going to do a video for the uh, Tom Sack yesterday, but it, it didn't really pan out. I woke up at like three minutes before the drop and I was like, I don't have time to set up. It's, go <laughs> it's not going to work. Uh, I entered a load of raffles, didn't hit any. Uh, even with it bricking, I, I couldn't hit any. So. Yeah, uh, regardless, that's going to cover this video. Like I said, I hope you enjoy, uh, kind of. <laughs> uh, other than that, I hope that you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you all next time. Peace.